Doo -doo 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 -doo. Welcome everybody to another episode of Baldur's Gate 3. Alright, um, so we left off here. Um, I'm going to backtrack really quickly because now that I've stopped being a dummy and realized that I can use jump like manually rather than having to wait for it to do it like automatically. Um, I'd like... Oh, I'm totally going to grab this. That looks like it's going to be important to some, some reason or another. Um, but yeah, so like, okay, so what I was saying. Um, now that I've I've stopped being stupid and figured out that I can, uh, that I can um, jump manually to get places, um, there are a couple other places um so there's, there's a couple other places that I do want to explore. I'm just going to do one of them right now. One of them is back in... Oh, sweet. Yeah, we're going to take both of those. Um, one of those is uh, in the in the Druid's Grove. Um, and I'm not going to go all the way back there right now. Uh, because I know we're going to eventually go back there once we kind of make progress on all the Druid stuff. Um, so we, we will get back there uh but for now i'm not gonna do that and but i am gonna go back to there's the one ledge that i couldn't get up um and i am going to see if we can jump up that ledge once i'm done pilfering all of this poor dead family stuff i'm assuming that's what this is. family of dead refugees or something i'm gonna take all their potatoes those are mine now they're not using them they're dead you're just a waste Look, a fallen tree, my favorite. <laughs> oh, I think it's hilarious that they, uh, they just kind of, you know, put random things like that around for you to explore. Sorry, I'm updating my little, my little item identifier map. Okay, so the, so the thing that I want to do, oh, is I'm, am I getting too far? Are getting too far? This right here, I want to see if we can, like, jump that, jump up that, or something. Now that I, like I say, now that I understand that you can manually make your character jump. Can we do this? Good idea. Right yeah, there. we can. Look at this. Watch this. Look at that leap. Look at the, look at those ups. God, gosh dang it, Belinda. She's got the, she got the hops, man. Are you kidding me with that? Okay, anyway. So yeah, we totally can get up here. Oh, that's so cool. That's really cool. I'm glad I I'm glad I finally figured that out. I wonder how many people were watching me like frustratedly not go anywhere and were just losing their minds because I'm sitting here being too dumb to recognize that the tool that I needed to be able to do that was, you know, available to me all along. I'm like sitting here thinking like, oh, there must be another character that eventually I'll be able to, you know, use to get up there and to check these places and stuff and Nope, you just had to, you just had to not be dumb. <laughs> I'm up here. So using, just to toss something out here too, because like I know I talk pretty openly about the fact that I'm using a map. Some people might worry about like spoilers or does it like ruin, uh oh, uh oh, what's happening? Who are you? My, my, what manner of place is this? A path to redemption? Or a road to damnation? Who the heck are you? Hard to say, for your journey is just beginning. Okay. What would suit the occasion? Hmm. The words to a lullaby, perhaps. What on earth are you possibly the talking mouse about, dude? Smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that love was that. <laughs> they do know how to write them in Cormir, don't they? Well met, I am Raphael. Very much at your service. Dude, who the heck are you? Um, yeah, right. So it's the pretty words. If you want to threaten me, don't disguise it. Okay, pleasure, I'm Melinda. Let's do that one. I'm sure, in more ways than one. 
We should have a chat, you and I, but not here. This quaint little scene is decidedly too middle of nowhere for my tastes. Hey. Come. I don't want to. Okay, I guess I don't have a choice. What is happening? Where am I? What is going on? There. Middle of somewhere. Um, I do not like the ominous organ going on right now in the background. <laughs> this is incredible. Okay. Um, yeah. The house of hope where the tired come to rest and the famished come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake, enjoy your supper. I don't After trust all, this guy at all. It might just be your last. What is happening? Yeah, I'm getting tired. You know what? Belinda and I were Fair both. Enough. Yeah. Oh, cool. <laughs> that looks better than a devil you don't know. <laughs> a devil you do. Okay, but like. Am I a friend? Potentially. An adversary. Conceivably. But a savior, that's for certain. Um, yeah, I don't, like, I feel like there's, like, this conversation is one that he's continuing as though we've been having it before, and I don't know if it's just because I haven't been playing this game for a little while, but I have no recollection of who this guy is or what he wants or anything that's going on here. I have no recollection of this. Okay, yeah, what makes you think I need Come saving? Now. Why play hard to get when you're in deep over your tadpole head? Okay, so One he knows skull, that. Two tenants and no solution in sight. And wrong, wrong, wrong. All, There's a guy. I'm going. I'm. That. I got a guy. Um. Yeah. And what is madness but a denial of reality? Dude, you're Still, gonna have to tell me your side of the deal I if you want me to. You change your mind before it's changed for you. Ha! Ah, clever wordplay. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair. That's when you'll come knocking on my door. Okay. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. Okay. This is, dude, you need to talk a little faster. Like, this is just taking forever. Um. Okay, we'll, we'll indulge him. I know this is playing with fire here, but we'll indulge him. I'll be around. Watching you squirm like a tadpole through a nice, juicy brain. All those pretty little symptoms, sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say you're a paragon of luck. I know something. I'll be there when it runs out. We gotta know something and I don't like it. Okay, anyway, that was weird. Okay, that was weird. Anyway, I'm gonna keep stealing crap. Dang it. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh boy. This barrel. Ooh, ooh. Elixir of heroism. Yeah, we'll take that. And we'll take the potion. Wait, I do like I do like free things that I find on the road. Ooh, a skeleton. Pendant. Ooh. Take that. Why were they here? Oh, the harpers. Interesting. Oh, sweet. There's a chest up there. Yes. 
I've, I've kind of reached a point with this game. So, like, I, I was for a little while trying desperately to, like, fit everything into a sense of, like, oh, I should keep track of this, I should keep track of that. Oh, that seems important, I should do that. Um, I have very quickly... Uh, I guess I shouldn't say very quickly, but by now I have definitely kind of abandoned any of that mindset about things. Um, but yeah, here we go. At the back of the crevice lies a bag enfolded in the chitinous squabbling of spiders. A shiny gold coin pokes from its mouth. Ooh. Oh, shiny gold coin. Um, yeah, let's survey the spiders. So we got um, plus zero. Okay, we just got to get a ten or above. Yeah, there we go, Belinda. Hunting the glue. creatures clutch the pouch possessively. You have no doubt a spider egg is nestled within. Okay. Um, yeah, let's do the animal handling. Belinda's good at that. Ah. Wow, Belinda. Okay, hold on. Can we? Do we have inspiration? Do we have inspiration? Yeah, I'm. I'm totally gonna use it on this. We might as well. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. With a plus five, there's no reason to not try it again. You know, that's a pretty good chance of getting that success. All right, there we go. One by one, the spiders retreat to the rear of the crevice, lulled by your murmurs. Yeah. Everyone, everyone loves Belinda's lulling murmurs. Boldly reach for the bag. Boldly reach when none have reached before. Cool. I got a pouch. Um, I want to view it. We'll take those coins. So can we, um... I, I just wanna... Okay, I see. So we can kinda like that that's that's what I want to be doing um, those right there like that yeah I want to be like empty ouches like that's our camp supplies let's just pockets back ouch does that have anything yeah so like this is how I want to so let's sort by type here. Yeah, there we go. Keep things sorted like that. That makes it a whole lot easier. Oh, that's so much better. Oh, I'm so glad I did that. Okay. Chain. Fly bag. Alchemy pouch. Yeah, it's got all that stuff. Yeah, like, I think I want to try and do that because you can just, like, put items upon items in there. Um... Although I don't get the sense that this game is actually particularly concerned about, do you have the bag space? Because it's just, it's, I mean, it's clearly operating on the, the carry weight system, right? Um, I don't get the sense that it's actually particularly concerned about that, but it's, you know, good to keep it in. Good to keep things organized and in mind and all that kind of stuff. Um. How did we get up here? Where was the path? And our way down. Making our way back down. Okay, there we go. I am glad I did that, though. That seems kind of, like, interesting and important. What we sort of, you know, discovering that one dude and what he's up to and everything. Where's my team? There they are. Hop, 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 hop. Coming along, coming along. Okay. Let's now make our way back over here. Yeah, no, that was totally worth it. Using, having, having figured out the whole jump thing, I think is going to genuinely open up a lot more of the map to me. Um, that I've just been ignorantly avoiding and ignoring. It was too silly to <laughs> recognize that I had that power. Um, yeah. Cool. Okay, um, I, okay, we'll, we'll check this body and backpack over here. Um, but I'm not going to go in that city yet. I want to go back down. I want to check out this other side of the forest and see if there's stuff to gain down here as well, I think is what I want to do. Um, 
Take the backpack here. So. Actually, do I want to do that? Or do I want to go visit the town? For I, I, the intention is I'm going to explore the whole map. That is 100% what the intention is always for everything. Um, I don't know. Maybe I do want to go into the village and just see what there is around there. Because I'm... This whole area is kind of like a pocket on the map that I'm in. Um, and it's like the, the forest is kind of expansive and the town seems actually kind of finite. Like, I always try to find whatever, like, the next most finite chunk of area is and then explore that area to completion. So maybe we will go into the city, explore within the walls the bounds of the city, and then we'll go about the rest of the forest. Maybe that's the way to do it. Moonhaven, okay. Yeah, let's go in here. Let's see what's in this town here. Oh, it's a blighted village. Well, well, boys. Booyah! Awesome, what a name. I... <laughs> find the goblins terribly amazing in this game. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Okay, um... Let's do persuasion. Um, yeah, let's do that one. Got a ooh. Okay, we got a plus three. We need a fifteen. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. And I use my last intimidation. <laughs> okay. Well. No. Oh, no. Here's what I'm thinking. We kill you. And I'll keep your ears to remember the occasion. I don't like that one. Don't don't Van Gogh me. Van, more, Van don't. I don't want to be Van Gogh. I want to be... Van don't. Van stop. Van knock it off. Oh boy. We're, we're, in, the, we're in deep here. Okay. Oh, because they get a surprise run. I was like, what is happening? Because of the surprise round. Oh man, we're really in it. Oh boy. Ah, beans. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay. All right. Not the strongest start that we could have had there, but that's okay. So the trick always with every battle is you want to find. Okay, four, four, nine, nine. Eight. Okay. The trick is always. Oops, sorry. I'm bumping my mic and making everyone go deaf. My apologies. Um, the trick always with these types of things. I know I talk about it a lot. Um, the trick always is to. Okay, so we've got one in there and one in there that we kill. You just want to try and make sure that your that you have everyone focusing on one creature at a time. If that makes sense. You you want to do everything you can to try and take out one creature at a time. You want to put everyone's efforts into that. Because what you want to do is you want to try and kill as many of them as quick as you can. Um, oh, he has his vampire bite now. Ooh, that's interesting. That's good to know. Okay, um... For now, we're gonna end the turn. We're not. I don't think there's. You could bite anyway. But you wanna you so because what you wanna worry about is you're always worried about the action economy, as I always call it. You wanna minimize the number of actions your enemies get. Right? See, they're getting a lot of turns here per one turn of us. Like they're getting a lot of actions. Um, or just bonus action heal up just. Here. And then I want to. Arrow attack to try and take this guy out. There we go. Yeah, because you want to reduce the number of attacks your enemies can make on you. The more attacks you're receiving, the more chances to be damaged, chances to be stunned, whatever. Like, the, the more stuff, the more times your enemies can do stuff to you, the more that they can just do to you. And you want to minimize that. You want to take away their opportunity to do as much as possible. Okay, so we need to get... We, we need to think about getting that guy down. He's doing a lot of stuff to us here. Let's get in. Go ahead and use our movement to just get in and out of the fire there. And now... 
Got this guy right here. I want to, yeah, I want us to try and pick him up. Okay, that's all right. We're gonna miss. That's that happens. End of turn. Let's get again out of there. Now you've got spells. Let's try and uh, Eldritch Blast him. There we go. Good. So oh, I didn't do as much as I was hoping to do there. Um, take a potion. Definitely need to do that. You, Asterin, get out of there. Okay, now let's... Ah, shoot, we're still kind of bunched, though. That's, that's on me. I should... About that a bit more intelligently. Um, you want to... That costs an action. I mean, we could establish that, but I kind of actually want to just... 65% chance, or... Oops, nope, that's not what I want to do. Or 75. Let's do the 75% chance. There we go. So we took him out. Good, 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 good. So now we've got two less chances of taking damage, which is, that's the type of thing that we want to be getting at here. Ail, stop. It hurt. Okay. All right. Um, Belinda, let's take a 55% chance to hit. Or the other one up here, what do we have? Either way, it's 50. Okay. Belinda's not actually excellent with bone arrow. That's fine. Um, do this, or we could... They're both kind of struggling. Let's throw... Oh, shoot, I can't. Hold on a sec. All right, well, let's just keep ourselves good to go here, and then we'll just give ourselves a short rest uh, once we're done. Let's... And which bolt this guy? There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Okay, which bolt him down? End your turn. You. Let's have you quickly drink up and heal yourself a bit here. And let's just take him out if we can. Oh, he's still got a hit point. Stinker. Yeah, stinker up there. All right, end your turn. Now, Sterian. Now I think you should be able to finish this guy off, right? There we go. Cool. And then... The only one left is the one hiding in there. I'm gonna come in here. I'm gonna move over there. Okay, so we can't... What if we... These boots have seen everything. Get a better angle... I don't want you to reach the destination. I want you to try and shoot this guy. Oh, yeah, because I don't have enough. Okay. Ah, you stinker. How can't... Um... I guess then, let's just... Well, okay, so because we're kind of in this situation, we can't hit him anyway. Let's go ahead and throw... There's our... Health potion. There we go. Throw that at him. Take it! Yeet! Hit him right in the face. Smack him in the face with a potion. That's how you heal people up. Hit him in the face with it. Alright, um. Um, okay. You, my dear friend, I want you to just kind of... Just have you kind of try and get yourself to be in a better position to maybe try and hit him. I don't know if we're going to be able to... Can we sneak that shot in on him there? We can... Yeah, he's got... He's hidden. Okay, yeah. That's fine. It was worth a shot. Um... We don't really have... Agathus Eldritch Blast. Shape Shift. Zadar. targets from you. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna be able to hit him. Let's just get everyone closer so we can maybe try and get Peters. Um, Cause he's all trying to hide and all that crap. So, okay, let's see what he does. That might actually be a more favorable angle. <laughs> to be perfectly honest here. Seriously? Okay. What path 
lies before me. There we go. That's all right. That's I guess that's the way we got to try it. We got to get everyone around here. Cuz you I'm guessing can't. Oh, hey. Path is interrupted. Dang it. Ah, yeah, there we go. You just got to play around with it. All right, there we go. Okay, goblins taken care of. So that was a good move there. How are we doing on time after that? Oh, we still got a little time to kind of loot the bodies here. That's cool. That's fun and cool and cool and fun. Like that. So. Okay. Um. Let's get. What I just texted him. How much farther can I go? Let's get up here and check these bodies out. <laughs> We're just going to loot these bodies, and then we'll start exploring this place properly. Um, we might call it a little short. We might call it an episode just because of the convenience of everything. This ritual staff? No, I don't. I might, yeah, I might call it once we're done with these guys, and then we'll start exploring the city, or this little village, on the next episode. We'll see. I don't know. I guess not. We still got, what, like five minutes? Four minutes? I don't know. Man, I don't know. I'm so bad at this. I'm such an amateur. Why does anyone... I hope... I hope People understand just how amateur and garbage at this I am. <laughs> I mean, I feel like it's pretty obvious, but you just, you never know. I feel like sometimes people get expectations about stuff and it's like, nah. Ooh, a moss-covered key? Heck yeah, I'm gonna take that. Are you kidding me? Okay. Cool. So. Let's see what we have around here. Shabby wooden doors. Oh, but those are locked. I wonder if the, the key... Um... Oh, but we can lockpick it. Okay, um... And let's have... Let's be a Starian here. Okay, difficulty is a 10, 4, 8, and 11. Okay, yeah, we're gonna definitely achieve this. Oh, I told show the total bonus down there. I'm just being dumb. Let's say yes. Cool. Let's move. Oh, um, I'm gonna have a short rest here. Awake and alert. Heavy wind doors. Oh, oh, this takes us someplace. Okay. Where does this take us? Oh my gosh, we're in like a whole place. Sorry, I just like transferred to my map. We're in like a whole place down here. Yeah, absolutely. We're gonna explore this. Um. Yeah, uh, but we are absolutely also going to explore this. What is, what's going on with you? Oh, he's got his arcane hunger. Um, let's feed him something. Can we... Um, let's check our inventory here. There's... Guidance. Uh, yeah, we can... Can we... Send to Gale. Right, and then let's... Put things there. Now, Gale... Let's have you go ahead and Gale approves. That hit the spot. I can feel it work. The magic, it's like a lullaby that sings to sleep the demon inside. A metaphorical demon, I haste to point out, but no less dangerous. And no less bound to wake up again to continue its ravages. Such is the nature of all monsters. Calling yourself a monster? Um. Yeah, um. Yeah, right there it is. <laughs> I've seen the data. Uh, be glad, glad you're feeling better. Yeah, let's do that one. That's Belinda. So She's bad. nice. Once you get used to it, and on the plus side, my tower in Waterdeep has never been so free of clutter. Hmm. <laughs> I think that's fair. <laughs> I understand I ask a lot from you with few answers in return. But in time, all will be told. If you say so. Um. Yeah. That could My help. Lady, I bow to your boundless kindness. Okay. Um. Cool. Alright. That seems like a good way to round out. Let's get going. Um. This episode. We're basically at time. By the time I've finished babbling my farewells, it'll be time. So thank you so much for, uh, for joining me on this, this episode. I uh, love and appreciate every one of you. 
uh, go go feed a necklace to your starving friend. As we've learned from this game, it's a good thing to do, and it'll make his tummy feel better. Okay, bye.